justificación, pero... Bankers Without Borders is... It's an opportunity. An opportunity. An opportunity for somebody to... Go in and apply your professional skills. To a, a very, very valuable service. For the social sector, specifically for microfinance. And really get to work with a fantastic organization and, and feel like you're making a difference with your time. It's helping someone sitting at your desk, knowing what you already know. Bankers Without Borders is an initiative to match skilled volunteers from the private sector with uh, projects within the microfinance sector to really help organizations that are working to serve the needs of the poor. Bakers Without Borders steps in to be that platform that brings together the stakeholders, the microfinance institution, the individual or, in, or team who's willing to volunteer their time, and the company who's often sponsoring that team. We're really about using a variety of different uh, professionals. I work in the Sovereign Risk Analysis and Advisory Team at JP Morgan. 30-year career in banking. My marketing background. In the Government and Transportation Finance Group. My background from advertising. Involves a lot of strategy and, and business development. We have more than 5,000 individuals around the world who are part of Bankers Without Borders. By bringing in all these pro bono consultants, what we've effectively been able to do is help uh, Grameen Foundation and the organizations that we work with conduct meaningful work that otherwise wouldn't have been prioritized because they didn't have the resources to get the work done. One was um, on a landscape analysis that we did of the microfinance environment in Turkey. There are two parts of my contribution. One, uh, most importantly, was my local knowledge, just being from Turkey, understanding uh, how the various bodies, the various stakeholders in microfinance, how they fit into the greater picture. The second part, in general, is just the, the skills that every employee of the investment bank has in terms of being diligent and in, in, uh, analytical in, in uh, thinking through an argument. There was a combination of technical expertise that they brought plus access that was really, really important to the project. Employees have said that there's just been huge personal but also professional growth. Um, they've said that it's just given them an opportunity to use their knowledge in a new way. It's given them leadership opportunities and just in general has, you know, broadened their worldview. This is the village itself. The project relates to a social venture in Indonesia. It's a micro-franchise operation started by two young Indonesians who uh, saw an opportunity to create jobs for poor women. So my role has been to kind of help them look at the, at the business issues. So it's very experienced in doing a big picture thing in terms of where we're we going is as a company. It, even though we have a social mission, but we need to survive as a company and then bring this the, not, not only the network, but bring the know-how. What used to take me months to do, now I can do within a week. We couldn't have achieved some of the things that we've achieved this year without Bankers Without Borders. We've had more than 440 volunteers engaged on specific projects. Collectively, they have donated more than 50,000 hours, and we estimate that to be about $4 million worth of donated services. What's great about this program in particular is that we're using it not just for Grameen Foundation staff, but for the microfinance sector as a whole. Bankers Without Borders is creating an army of a new kind of philanthropist, what we like to call a skillanthropist. Uh, folks around the world who are some of the best and brightest in the corporate sector, they want to be part of the solution in terms of ending poverty around the world. I feel like all of us have this inherent thing of like, I want to go and do something, but I don't have time. And this is something of being like, we'll bring it to your desk. All you have to do is what you do anyway. Just do it for Grameen.